A mother stands by the front room window and stares out, lost in her thoughts at what unexpectedly transpired in a well-planned life. What would she do now? Everything was going along smoothly, and now her husband was leaving her. What would she tell the children? How could they afford to stay in the house when she had no job? She hadn't worked outside of the home in years. What's next? I want to live my life closer to thee. There are times in our lives when we feel paralyzed. We can't make a decision and nothing seems to make sense. Our indecision leaves us feeling hopeless. Jesus' disciple Peter experienced that at times in his life. He had problems that caused him to stumble, to falter, and even fail as a disciple. There were times when Peter appeared to have lost hope. In 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 7, we read, Casting all your anxieties on him because he cares for you. So what about you? How are you handling the unexpected changes in your life? Now is the time to let this verse of scripture speak to you personally. Jesus comes to you in life-altering times. He offers you hope. He's there to guide you through the trials of life and deliver you safely on the other side. You're never alone in life. Jesus is always with you. It is he who will guide you through those life-altering times. He's the one who offers you hope for this life and the life to come. Times will continue to change. We place our hope in Jesus because he never changes. Now is the time to cast all your anxieties on Jesus. He cares for you. Pray with me. Loving Father, forgive me when I try to handle all the changes in daily life by myself. Help me to come to you and give you all of my cares and concerns. Thank you, Jesus, for always being with me every moment of my life. Amen. Thanks for joining us. If you're seeking services for symptoms of mental illness, please talk to your primary doctor or a health professional. Don't have one? Consider one of the resources listed here to find help. And God's peace to you.